hello, gotta be quiet because Ben has gone to sleep, silly me, always doing recording things too late when people have to get up and go to work in the morning and stuff. Anyway, um, so yeah, the same time news came out, it was the Black Ops gameplay of it for something different and I think it worked out pretty well and Ben liked it, which is good because he, he can be a tough critic, uh, but he was a fan of that and I think getting good reception, so that's good to hear and it's not, not an always thing, it's just something different, something fun to do. Uh, had a lot of fun playing it as well, oh, even though I played so terrible. God, well, it's hard to talk and play at the same time. I just played a game then when I did a bit better. <clears throat> and you can, there's so many unlocks in Black Ops 2, so many things, like, because I left it Black Ops for a little bit. I think, what was the last one I got? I think the last one I got was Black Ops 1. And it didn't have so many different upgradey bits and add on things and. So many unlocks and tokens, and they're not kill streaks anymore. They're p- score streaks. Ooh, I'm behind the times for this game. Anyway, um, it is it is a bit of fun bringing back some old memories. Oh, Call of Duty Four was just the greatest thing ever, and then the others after that were really good. But that I don't know. That just seemed like a bit of a game changer. Call of Duty Four. Oh, good graciousness. Um. So yeah, with the Black Ops, I I think I said it at the end of the Sam Time News episode. But I um I did record it all the day before, except it recorded the camera, the like the webcam good cam for the face and the audio, my voice on the microphone, but it didn't save the gameplay of the actual black ops, which was annoying. I don't know, something wrong with the program just stuffed up, it just didn't want to do it. Um So anyway, so I didn't have the gameplay and then Ben says, Oh, Black Ops 2, that is the theatre mode. I'm like, yes. It records your game so that you can upload them to YouTube. It's specifically made for that. So then I went in, went into the PlayStation and I said, all right, let's have a look at the theater mode, recent games. Nothing. Nothing. That would have been the best thing ever. It didn't record the screen cap. So then I just go to where it recorded anyway and it would be there and it wasn't there. And it ruined it. The perfect idea gone. So that was very annoying, to say the least. So I had to... Reshoot the whole thing, but I think the second shoot was a bit better than the first. I think it worked out pretty well. Uh, so I was uh, happy with that. I used a different capture program. I used the one I should have used, the, the proper one. Um, but it, it's good. I think it, it worked out alright, and it's good to um, know it all works. And I think, like, to actually record it, I think it was 8 gigabytes of video, but I'm happy that when I compressed it, it went to less than a gig. It like went to 800 meg, and then I compressed it a bit further to 400. So it doesn't have a silly, gigantic file size either, which is great, good stuff, top notch. Yeah, um, I think that's, that's that's it for now. Uh, have a good day, good night, good everything, good chat. Ah, bye.